Welcome, Harrys. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, this week is the second week in November, and the week um, is the beginning from the 9th until the 15th. So I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Let's check in and see what exactly is going on. Um, so I see um, Archangel Metatron is here, and it's uh, Mercy. Archangel Metatron and it's Mercy. So it is a week where you can ask for Mercy, um, Aries, whatever that was happening and transpiring. You can definitely ask for Mercy in this week. Um, there is the, some sort of a hanger that is going to be coming to some of you at the workplace, uh, some sort of a conflict or anger. Um, but I see that um, um, it's um, um, some of you are going to be getting out of some sort of a situation because we see and then merriment there. So some of you are going to be having some sort of a hunger coming at you. And some of you are just going to be merrily taking yourself off in a, some sort of a way where you're asking for mercy and you're dealing with the anger that is coming to you from other people. So Monday is going to be communication. Monday is all about communication. It's all about uh, um, being conflicted over certain things and certain information. And I see the energy of uh, a clarity is going to be coming over some sort of a situation that has to do with a house or a company. And I see that some of you are going to be realized there, there is no new start for a company. So you business people, Whatever that was happening and transpired, I see that some of you are going to be worried about uh, um, your business, your company, your house, uh, and it's going to be finding out that there is not going to be any new start because uh, there has been some sort of a um, issue that was created, and you Aries is going to be finding out, uh, um, and there is going to be some worries that is going to be coming up. Uh, so there is no question about this. So Monday is here. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday is fire. Thursday is that you're coming out of some sort of a hardship. Friday is another fire sign. And worries in the weekend um, about creating a new start for yourself. Some of you are going to be happily merrily. Um, some of you need to call upon Archangel Metatron. Um, if he's not your guiding angel, then he will send your guiding angel in. But it's a week of mercy. Ask for mercy. Ask for mercy, ladies and gentlemen. So who are you going to be dealing with? A whole lot of issues and problems with your housework um, is going to be coming up. Um, a lot of your, your communication is, uh, is going to be clear. A lot of your communicating in order to get out of some sort of a hardship with a house or at the workplace. Um, some of you need to protect yourself. There is a whole lot of worries. So we see um, twice nine is here. So um, something is going to be coming to an end, whether some of you jobs or um, some of you contracts, uh, um, some sort of an ending is going to be coming in, okay? I see a whole lot of worries for you, Aries. So, so married people is going to be having some sort of issues that needs to be resolved okay some sort of a uh, issue is going to be coming up for married people so um be aware of this because um this situation is going to be um coming up and this is um where you are at this moment okay so let's go in and check this week out Light has been shed on some sort of a information um, and uh, whatever this information is and whatever that was transpiring, I see a balance is going to be coming in and this is going to be, um, this is going to be positive. So if you notice, it's two major arcana with some sort of an issue, some sort of a conflict that was going on, light is going to be shed. 
Um, then we see some sort of a decision that needs to be made um, because whatever the information that came out, uh, um, some sort of uh, information and problems, uh, um, issues that was transpiring. Um, then I see um, some of you, I see um, a young person, some sort of information is really coming out because this is a week of information and some of you could be dealing um, with people who are coming at you. And I see justice, justice came up, um, justice came up on um, some of you Aries, some, some of you Aries, justice came up on you. I see justice um, come up um, with a situation that some of you Aries are dealing with. I see the energy of the devil. Energy of the devil. Wow. Wow. So. Okay. Wow. It, that is just so straight. Okay. All right. So what we see is happening and transpiring here is, is that, whew, mm, mm, mm. okay, this is one of the weirdest, weirdest. Just as the sun and the nine of cups, obviously a cycle is going to be over for some of you. And I see people who had uh, um, a business together, some sort of a business, some sort of a contract, some sort of a business together. Um, I see that uh, you will overcome some sort of obstacles and issues. Okay. Then I see the energy of the devil and justice and um, the knight of swords. And I see they're coming down on a and a Taurus and a Sagittarian they're really coming down on a Taurus and a Sagittarian there is just some real wacky things that is happening and transpiring I see a lot of you are going to be luckily coming out of the situation so light has been shed and I see justice um is um, standing up against a Taurus and a Gemini, a Taurus and a Gemini. There was some sort of an issue. Um, justice is going to be coming down on a uh, Aquarian. There was some sort of an issue um, with an Aquarian. Some of you are using negative forces in order to... Um, a deal with certain sort of information. No, it's not going to be happening. Um, yeah. Um, then I see a situation at work. Um, a lot of, um, let's say you're in some sort of a contract or people are going to be, if you're looking for work, I see some sort of a new contract is going to be open up because a lot of you was worried about work. I see justice is coming up and some of you and it's as if uh, whatever is happening in transpiring is as if uh, truth is coming at you. Truth is coming at you. And uh, whoever is in a relationship uh, with a, a Taurus and a Virgo, I see some sort of information is coming out about a Taurus and a Virgo. And they're coming down on a Sagittarian, an Aquarian, a Sagittarian, and a Taurus. Um, they could be finding out the works of some corrupt lawyers also. But if you notice the energy of the devil that is on top, oh, the energy of the devil and I see justice is coming down and some sort of a decision needs to be made. Some sort of a balance needs to be made with some sort of a situation that is happening and transpiring. So... Um, for some of you um, in a corporation institution, they're going to be finding out uh, um, that some of you were connected um, in some sort of a mess up of situation that has transpired. So balance, twice balance is here with some sort of a situation at work. 
decision needs to be made and I see communication is going to be coming in. So if some of you were looking for a, a new um, contract or a new work uh, um, situation, um, I see that uh, um, some of you are going to be worried, especially people between the age of 18 and 45 um, is going to be worried. I see they find out uh, some sort of a situation that was going on with a group of people and how a group of people manipulate and stole a lot of money. And I see light has been shed on the situation. And I see some of you are going to be victoriously overcoming a couple that is a Taurus or a Virgo or a Cancer or a Virgo um, or a Taurus. Yeah. Um, so there is a lot of things, but justice is here and justice is not, is that that you're winning some sort of a situation. I think the other person is winning over you because justice is here. It's not showing up who, and it's as if balance, some sort of a conflict needs to be balanced out. Justice is in, um, this week where some sort of a karmatic situation needs to be rebalanced. Um, I see a couple. If you are a couple, if you are married or in a relationship, I see some sort of information is going to be come to you, coming to you that there is not going to be any new start. So I don't know what was happening and transpiring with you couples, but I see um, that sort of a situation is going to be coming in where um, it's as if we were open for some new start, but um, it's not going to be happening. So it could be with a business. So if you had a business with your partner, I see some sort of information is going to be coming in where um, uh, you're going to be finding out that uh, um, whatever is happening and transpiring, there is not a new start. It's as if some of you business people are going to be realizing there is no new start. There's no new start that is going to keep coming up. I see some of you um, who are partnered up and had a business. I see they have found out that the business was not for you, um, and that you too have used someone else's information in order to create this business. And I see the, um, the universe is saying no. So I see if you notice temperance, um, the devil, some sort of a balance need to come in with some sort of a work and um, business situation. Light has been shed there. I see some of you are going to be successfully overcoming some sort of an issue with a cancer. And I see truth is going to be coming out. So there is some sort of a problem at work. So be aware of this. Okay. Gotta go. Namaste. Please remember to like and share these videos. There was um, a whole lot that is happening. And it's going to be happening in this week where people are going to be facing themselves. Um, a whole lot of situation, a whole lot of communication is going to be here and people are going to be have to be facing themselves. So it depends on what is happening and what is transpiring for you in your world. But it's as if uh, there were things that was not uh, totally, um, there was things that was not totally um, balanced out. And I, I see it's as if... Uh, you guys have to return in order to balance out these situations. So, however, it is coming up for you. It's time that you regain balance with a situation. Okay? I gotta go. Namaste.